Okay, that's a bit of a strange one now. My boss Paul just came up to me. Carl, you busy? Uh, well, I'm like doing my job, Paul. And he's like, would you be available to go out to Western Airport? Why do you need me to go out to Western Airport, Paul? Because there's someone who wants to drive you in an Audi R8 down the runway. Would you be up for it? Western Airport. Paul, what an utterly ridiculous question. A fat head helmet. <laughs> Gonna kill one. I can't get my helmet on. Oh, thanks, God. He's the floor. Oh So why exactly am I here? There's an event happening on April the 14th called Runway Club Live, where pretty much you're gonna have cars like that, drag racing down the runway here, and anyone's gonna be able to come along and have a look. Because of that, the guys have invited me along here today to um, sit in some of these cars and be driven very, very, very fast down the runway here at Western Airport. Why do I have the distinct feeling that the paramedics and the firemen are here for me? Okay, first of all, yes, I am aware of how utterly ridiculous I look. Dave, you're about to bring me out in uh, this car behind us. This is Kia's brand new sports car. Probably important to put my seatbelt on. How the hell did you get a job as cool as this? This is marketing in Kia that I work in. Can I just stop you there for a second, then, Dave? So you tell me you're not a racing driver? You're, you're in marketing and you're... Seems like a pretty normal car so far. Nice and quiet and surprisingly smooth. We've got different modes. Okay. So eco, comfort, sport, and then sport plus. Whoa. I'm just gonna be honest with you, I'm still slightly disconcerted that you told me that you're a marketeer. Then you're not a racing driver. Oh, here we go. That's 150, 160, 170, 180. Oh my God, the brakes. Whoa. That was your spin with a, a marketer. Ha! How did we go that far in that little time? Now that we're out, God, my hair looks good. Your hair looks better than mine anyway. Cheers, Just as impressive as how quick it stops. It was the first time my face kid. was about to hit the windscreen. It's ridiculous. I have too much loose skin on my face. In a BMW M... M2. M2 now with Ian. It's a 3 litre, 365 brake horsepower, rear wheel drive, turbocharged, manual beast. I want to see if I can get down the runway keeping a completely straight face. Okay. So this is my straight face. I am not enjoying this at all. <laughs> I, I've always had this thing that if I ever won the lotto, I would buy myself an Audi R8. I'm most likely not going to win the lotto. So on my bucket list of things to do is to just be in one while it's driving. I think it might be about to happen, so I am trying to keep my cool. It's the R8 Spider uh, oh. V10, so uh, 540 horsepower uh, and 0 to 100 in 3.6 seconds. Say, let's say I did win the lotto tomorrow yeah. and I wanted to buy something like this. Well, yeah. What kind of money would this run me? Uh, this one retail uh, 278. Now, genuine question. Where is it? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Please don't yeah, tell no. me that's how you start the engine. Yeah, no, this is it. All your controls are here. So your different driving modes all oh. here as well. So the virtual cockpit. Are you good to go? I am absolutely yeah, good I to go. Can... What's actually great about the convertible is you can hear the engine. What would be the difference between this? I drive a 1.6 diesel, so. Well, this is 5.2 liters. <laughs> Oh, look at that. Just a beautiful, clear runway and in probably the most beautiful car ever built. This has been a good day at work. Okay, you ready? Okay, yeah, let's do it. Okay. okay. Been on a roller coaster that just takes off really fast. It's how quick it stops. Face is about to hit the camera. Oh well, that was, was quite a 
quite something. Uh, I know for a fact when I look back at this footage, I'm gonna be quite embarrassed at how I look, but I don't care because I just ticked off my bucket list.